My name is Noel Wurzius, I'm Product Manager for Network APIs. Today we are here at Landgrabenweg Bonn at one of the Telekom buildings and we're testing Network APIs together with Nokia. This drone, what we're seeing in this video, is not operated by people near nearby, it's operated from Belgium. We are operating the first Bivilos flight cross country in Europe over the public 5G network of Deutsche Telekom. Operating a Bivilos drone means that you're going for the full redundancy. What you often see is that the network is very crowded, so it's very crucial then that the safety drone can be programmed, that they can have the bandwidth they need. Digital world is moving into and a new type of application. So these applications also, they will have a very high dependency on the network performance and network specialization. So the key to make this kind of applications work is the ability for the application developers to program the network. It's not one company that can make all this work. And what happened here today, we had an ecosystem of companies working together. It's a kind of European uh, partnership we do here. Nokia has prepared this, this excellent drone using or making use of the complete 5G capabilities of the network so that also we are able to see the drone in the unmanned traffic management systems so that we're really able to properly integrate this drone into the airspace. So in this use case, our two network APIs, Quality on Demand and Location Verification, are used by Nokia's platform Network as a Code, which is more or less an aggregator for network APIs. So they're integrating our APIs into their platform, offering them via different services like SDKs to developers. So in this use case here, what we're seeing today at Landkramweg is a drone which is flying using our both APIs. The first one, verifying that the drone is really in this place here. And the second one is quality on demand for the flight level. So even in a congested area, it's then possible for a defined time to getting more polarization out of the network so that your use cases are even working if there are thousand people around you. Your life will depend on these QADs. So you want to test it upfront. And that's what we actually did today. We made sure that uh, these programmable quality uh, demands are uh, possible. There are so many use cases which can be perfectly done with a drone over longer distances, with the ability of the network of Deutsche Telekom, with a true European player like Nokia. So I really think the market is seeking for a solution like that. Mm -hmm.